many times when we have a loved one or friend diagnosed with cancer, we feel helpless. What can you say? What can you do? In this month's Talk Pink, how one woman was inspired to reach out when her co-worker needed it the most. The Rock in Paris is a local eatery, but it's also a place for new friends like Karen Stivers and Ari Bobadilla to catch up. Her kindness. We didn't know each other really well. You know, we knew each other pretty well through work, but we've gotten to know each other a lot more since then. Bobadilla has shown Stivers the true meaning of friendship and inspiration. I don't know, something was nagging at me. Like, you know, gosh, I, I can't imagine what they're, the, the entire Stivers family is going through. That's because in June, at the age of 46, Stivers was diagnosed with breast cancer. A longtime mental health worker, she admits her own health didn't come first. I felt like for a long time, um, even before I started feeling the lumps, there was something nagging at me to go to the doctor. I didn't pay attention to that like I should have. Stivers had a double mastectomy and the removal of several lymph nodes. That's when a co worker became so much more reaching out to help. I wanted to get Karen's story out because she is so inspiring for me. Bobadilla wanted to help this wife and mother she worked with at Bourbon Community Hospital. She set up a GoFundMe page, her way of trying to help make the sting of cancer easier. Her simple gesture was humbling. I don't even feel like I can give words to it, honestly. Cancer can make you feel alone. Karen Stivers has learned that's not the case and is embracing. Being an inspiration herself to others with a life saving message. Keeping up with those yearly mammograms or if something in your body is saying, hey, something is wrong, realize that the most giving thing that you can do is get yourself checked. And that is so very true. Sivers just received word this week that her cancer has not spread, which was huge news to her family. She credits her faith and support system for getting her through this diagnosis. Now, I have a link to the Stivers Family GoFundMe page on our Talk Pink page. We also have a link to Coleman Lexington because it is never too early to start thinking about supporting the annual Race for the Cure. That is October 3rd in downtown Lexington. So check it out on Talk Pink on WKYT.com.